lines, the blue halter, the shorter one. The Mustang Mania Training Incentive Program had nearly 170 adoptions of wild horses and burros this year, a new record as the BLM has partnered with Matt and Stacy Zimmerman locally of the Mustang Heritage Foundation, and this has been going on for seven years. Oh, it's amazing. Because these horses are nice. I've seen them go any directions. They turn out to be hunter jumpers. They turn out to be dressage, rest, western riding, mountain horses, kind of anywhere you need to go. And it's kind of great for like people with small budgets to find yourself a gym. Casey Wittick will participate in the Mustang Mania for the third year in a row. She admits it takes a lot of work to train a wild horse. It is definitely an emotional roller coaster, so you're going to have some ups, you're going to have some downs. Like the cool thing about wild horses is they bring out the best in us, but also the worst in us. And so it's kind of a mutual training program. They train us as much as we train them. And like in the end of it, you walk away with a wonderful partnership and a better horse. Trainers like Casey have 118 days to work with these horses before a competition in Nampa at the Ford Idaho Center at the end of June. As programs like this is one way the BLM ensures these animals go to a good home. This is a, a big part of our adoption program here in Idaho, but there are other opportunities to adopt animals, um, especially around the Boise area, or even if you're not in the Boise area. In 2019, the BLM told us they had 50,000 wild horses in corrals around the country, and it costed $60 million to feed the animals, which equaled out to around three quarters of the BLM's overall budget. This is gonna reduce the, the cost that it's incurred by the BLM. 170 animals adopted, that's, that's a big deal to us. The BLM vets trainers in this program and Casey looks forward to working with our new Palomino Pinto mare that came from the Sailor Creek herd. I don't know, I'm gonna let my kids name her. I have an eight year old, a three year old, and a, four, and a five year old at home. And so they're, they're gonna compete and guess who gets to name it, so. Steve Dent, Auto News 6.